All right, I've got this Clark 190T turbo welder. Got it from the scrapyard. I've cleaned it all up a bit. Problem was it weren't wire feeding, so check the board, everything seems alright on that. Relays are clicking. Everything's working on that. So I tapped the motor a bit and it started to work, so I thought it was the brushes, but I think it's the motor worn. I'll just ask to see if we get a replacement from that from Clark, so wait for a reply on that. There's the drive unit and the gears. Basically bolts from this side, quite long bolts, go through the back part here, here's the old. This is where your motor connects to, into your gearbox, which is pretty easy. Just screwed onto them three screw holes. So it's pretty easy to work on these. Just the motors are easy to take off and replace. The gearbox setup is not very hard at all. These all pull off and the order is pretty easy to find. Even changing the board would be easy. I suppose that big relay switch would be in that toggle switch. Another point where they could break. That's like a solenoid for your gas. Thermal cut out here as well, which could open. So not a lot to these really. But that's it. Just gonna get a wait for the replacement motor. If I can't get one, I'll just try and clean up the contacts. Clean it up a bit, grease it up a bit. See if I can get it working a bit better. But yeah, really easy to work on these are. So if you need to change the wire feed motor, easy, just put six bolts, unbolt it, take apart your gearbox, you get these three screws that go through there. Like that. So you've got three that hold it in. If you can find a motor, if not, just put some new brushes in and clean it up. If you need to change the board, you just take the knobs off the front. Let's get that. That one's got a, a screw through there. And these two have that little bolt hole there that you undo and they pull off. Unscrew these fasteners. Two positive drive screwdriver, no, sorry, two Phillips screws, and that just pulls free. I've marked up all the wires. Top. Top's a white one, which is connected to your blue one. And three down is a white. Two down, three down, and bottom. And then you've got that second connector at the top. So really easy to work on. I'll put that motor in and see if it works.